Riding my e-bike to work has made a huge difference to my energy levels. I find I'm awake, I'm more alert, and I don't have that 3 p.m. slump where I'm reaching for chocolate. Honestly, the best thing about the commute that I want to tell you guys about is that I'm no longer in my car every day for about 30 to 40 minutes each way, and that has been the best thing for my mental health. I'm really there now, I've got a few big hills, but that don't matter on this thing, because I don't feel them. <laughs> Riding the bike usually adds about 20 minutes to my commute. Uh, however, uh, not often you get to uh, stop halfway and uh, have a look at the uh, giraffes at the zoo. I arrive awake and alert and ready for the day ahead. A vast improvement on throwing things together into the car and sitting in traffic for half an hour. One of the benefits about using a shared path on my commute is I avoid traffic delays. 10 metres that way is the Monash Freeway. At the moment, traffic is bumper to bumper and it's not going anywhere anytime soon. Um, the thing I am loving most about my bike is that it can go anywhere. So as you can see here on my front lawn, it's all grass. It's really wet because we've been inundated with floods lately. Um, and riding across the grass is just an absolute breeze. And this thing makes a cycle commute so easy. I mean, I get to cycle along the river to go to work, which is absolutely beautiful. So much better than driving on the road, being stuck in traffic. Well, what a peaceful way to start the day. No squabbling about whose music we're listening to in the car and who's in the front seat. Just jump on your bike, kids. Let's go. I take a few other things with me when I ride. Tools and spare parts in case I get a flat. Uh, a raincoat in case it rains. For lights, I have a front extension bar, which I keep two front lights on because it's always good to have a spare. And the back, I have an assortment of red lights. Hills are where e-bikes like this just come into their, their element. You could just fly up the hill 25 k's an hour and you're putting in barely any work compared to what you have to do. Um, so even the fact that I can do my 11 kilometer commute um, just half an hour, nice and clean, is amazing. And I'm sort of getting to work energized for the day. So I've had a little bit of exercise, but I'm not exhausted. So it's been wonderful so far. So I don't think, I don't see myself going back. Initially, it, were, it took me longer on bike than by car. But as I've gotten used to riding and learnt about new routes and new bike infrastructure, I've been able to decrease that time down to the same or even less time than um, driving my car. Commuting on an e-bike is quicker than taking the bus and honestly about the same time as it takes when you get stuck in traffic in your car and then have to go into the car park as well. With mudguards and a step through frame, it's easy to wear my office uniform on my ride. And with petrol costs on the rise, an active commute with the green team is a win-win.